Here at the show we got the new uh, drop and splash. It's a splash ride but with a very small footprint. Um, we have a free-floating boat attached to a track that is movable. So we have a U-shape of a track and then we move the track from one side to another, attach the boat at one point and then can splash it down. So we try to have a, have a ride that's uh, really a world's first and um, it's patented so you only will find it on our booth. Um, right now we are, um, yeah, we are in the final phase of Arthur, our suspended powered coaster, um, which is also a brand new ride system from our point of view. Um, we have some several um, new projects coming up uh, for 2014, so yeah, looks looks quite good for us. The last time we spoke a couple of years ago, you said your books were full. For yeah. Two years. Yeah. How are the books at the moment? It hasn't changed. So um, for 2015, you probably will get a ride, but it's late 2015 already. Yesterday was a very good day. We had a lot of uh, attendance, a lot of people asking for things. Today was a little bit slower, but I spoke uh, to a guy uh, today and he told me that he expected a lot of people tomorrow, so we'll see. We are pretty satisfied. Have you got any new products that you're displaying here? Um, on the quiet, we, we explained some new stuff, yeah. Yeah. So special clients? Usually. Special clients, yeah. Special clients that are in for something new that we will show them what is new. Yeah. But it's not big display. Sure. Um, when do we expect to find out about, about what it is it's new? Uh, once we've sold it and had the um, development time and, and lead time to deliver it is uh, more or less uh, one and a half years, two years. So. Within that time frame, you will see what what will be new. So, if there's someone interested in a new sort of thrilling ride, you're the people to come to, and you've got something special that no one else knows about. Exactly, we've got something special that nobody knows about it. Yeah, exactly. Look, the slimy things are stunned, completely harmless. Oh, by the way. You don't have to worry about hurting any of the infected victims. The laser intensity is customized to only stun the DNA of the spores. It can't harm anything else. Pretty sweet, huh?
we've got a number of new products in all the different areas of, of whitewater too with amusement parks and water parks. This particular one here is, is slide boarding where we're taking a new technology uh, into the water park industry. As, as you know, years ago, kids used to build forts and catch tadpoles, etc. Today, their strongest muscles are their thumb muscles. So we've taken that into the water park industry with head first mat riding in which we have a mat and in the handles we've, we've put on the controls here so that the kids can go down and when a green band comes they can hit a control and amass points. Uh, and obviously the targets as they go down change. There's also a memory in here so that they, they know, the, the system knows the customer so when the child goes down a second time it automatically dials up the targets a little bit, makes them a little bit more uh, difficult to achieve. And we've had a huge response uh, from the industry at large as a result of uh, introducing this new product. So that's showing the descent and, and uh, how the customer uh, accumulates points by hitting the, the various targets on the way down. And then at the end of the ride, when you come out the end, you, you, you finish and then uh, the scoreboard shows your name and the number of points uh, accumulated. The, the, the orange one in the, uh, at the end there is uh, the adrenal limb, and the key word there is the LIM at the end, linear induction motor, uh, in which you're in a raft with a, a very thin steel bottom that's, that is uh, charged and motors will shoot you uphill, and uphill as far as you want to go. So it's a uh, tremendously exciting ride. We installed that one into Guatemala, the Chaco Mill project there. It was the most beautiful park in Central South America um, in the jungle. The second one is the Aquasphere, uh, which is, as you can see, our, our globes, uh, orbs throughout the ride in which we have special effects, lighting and, and uh, sound to, to create a completely different theme in, in each one. The third one is the uh, fusion ride. It's where we take two iconic rides and put them together. This, in this case, the family Boomerango and Manta. Um, this was installed in uh, Nagashima Resort in Japan and won the Best New Product Award at the World Water Park Association this year. The fourth one is the Rattler. This one we installed into Yas Island, the most expensive water park in the world, over 300 million. Also into Legoland and Wet n Wild Vegas. Uh, which I know you're familiar with. Yeah. The fifth one was the Anaconda. This is the largest water slide uh, in, the, in the world, a 30-foot diameter slide. And this was installed into uh, Atlantis on Palm Island in, uh, in Dubai. A hugely successful addition to that park, and that's after we did the whole park originally a few years ago. We just signed a contract for a project in Nigeria. Um, it is interesting because, you know, it's the best Africa and the project is one of the major ones. Um, it has 22 zones including wildlife, amusement park, hotel complexes, shopping malls, um, also a water park. So we are the supplier of the water slides. Uh, we'll be having our King Cobra water slide, uh, which is our signature ride. The owner of the project is Delta, Delta Leisure. Um, company and the princess uh, of the region was here uh, signing the contract with our president so we are so happy that you know such a complex uh, is being built in West Africa you know uh, where most of the people do not have the, uh, the opportunity to go abroad and to try a water slide or a roller coaster so in their hometown they'll be having one. So it's exciting to be kind of moving into a new area of the world? Correct, correct. For us, for Pauline, this will be the first water park in that region and we're so excited. Each year we're doing around 200 water park projects all around the world but if you ask me this new location is very exciting. <laughs> And do you have any new products, new types of water slides that you've released here? Yeah, uh, actually we have launched a new product which is called Magic Sphere. Um, again, you can see the model here. It's a giant sphere, uh, four-person raft. Um, we just uh, completed the installation of it at Cartoon Network Amazon Water Park 
uh, which is going to open in Thailand, in Pattaya, uh, in March 2014. This is something exciting. This is the first installation. And what is interesting about the ride is that uh, within the ride, you'll be able to watch uh, a movie. So it's like a media integrated water slide. So that's the interesting part of it. And here at IARPA, it's, it's very busy. Has it been a good show for you? Very good. Each year, it's, it's been better and better. This year, uh, so far, we had so many visitors. And globally, it's been a better show. So uh, we're having visitors from all around the world. And plus, what I observed this year, uh, all of the people who are visiting, they're all very targeted. They have their uh, you know, projects, plans, and everything. So here, as you just saw, I mean, we just were signing contracts, so we're able to talk about the projects in details. That's wonderful to be here. <laughs> Oh, yeah. 